Hi fiends, this is Susie, your gaming guru, here to help you solve the puzzle of level 420 in Best Fiends. This one's called Behind the Line. Our goals, they're varied. Defeat five slugs, open six crates, and collect 50 lights. So, here are the lights along this side. Here are the crates bound by those lights. And then everything is bound up by all of these mushrooms but i do have a blue or sorry a black bomb here that if i can hit with another um bomb one of these bombs that should work this is in a good position to try to help me these guys are pretty good he goes horizontally but he might help over here one thing i notice is i'm not really thrilled the most i can get is 5 that may be about as good as i can expect because i do have four fiends here so i have four different colors on the board but because I know that I can try to restart without losing anything, uh, I'm going to do that. It's a little better. I'll go ahead and take it. I'm actually going to start with the purple here, and then the green will settle down a little bit more. Yeah, see, I think this works a little better. The more quickly I can get some bombs, the more quickly I can set off this black bomb. Actually, I'll have to get several bombs because notice... There's stuff over that. So um, I'll have to get two bombs, one to clear out the muck, the slug sludge, and then one to detonate it, I believe. All right, but I'm gathering quite a bit of these colors here. I think I'm actually going to go for the yellow, get over to these um, light bulbs and then try to make a double collection. Try to grab some light bulbs along the way. Am I going to, hold on, I can grab one more this way and then hopefully these will turn blue. We got one of them to turn blue so I can match up blue next time except I'm going to go for the purple. Uh, it looks pretty good. The The bad news is I'm not collecting any of these mushrooms and clearing things out. The good news is I might be making bombs that I can use. And I really need those bombs. Look at that. I can do that and get a bomb. I'm going to go for it, even though it's not... Well, it does help with um, the slug collecting. But more than that, I'm trying to go for opening up that black bomb quickly. Now I'm going to try to put the blue together because everything should run nicely. And then that'll clear out a lot so I can reach down to this black bomb. Yep, look at this. Unfortunately, that sets off the yellow, though. I think what I might do is this and take the, the stuff off on its own. Oh, now I've got this purple bomb. Oh, I would be setting everything off. Yikes. I'm going to do this. Because I also need those slugs. And then I'm going to hope I get another green here. And then I do this. And I open this up. And then I use the purple. Nope. It took it all out. It took off the slug sludge and the and detonated the bomb. Okay, so now I need to probably focus on the lights, right? And I can do that this way. Focus on the lights and the crates. Oh my goodness, the crates. Okay, I spent way too much time on that black bomb, but it does help to have things clear. It's just that I spent so much time on it, I actually kind of cleared things out while I was going for that black bomb. All right, now I've got my perspective again. That's not a bad move. It's not fantastic. I'm hoping we get some blue. There we go. Got more blue. Ooh, I think I'll... Nope, I'm going to do this. So now I'm hitting those crates. I feel a bit better about that. Let's hope these turn purple. Got a little bit of purple, and we can connect it all. Wow, can we connect it? That looks good. Still three crates, still one slug and still 15 lights, but I have six moves. That doesn't feel too bad to me. Let's go this route. Now, I think I'm going to go ahead and do something that helps me get the crates. 
There's one crate. There's another. Oh, I'm going to do this here. And then this. And then what? Look at that poor guy down there. I need to try to drop this downward and use that to blow that up. Okay, so this looks pretty good. Oh no, because that bomb stops. I forget that. Why do I forget that so much? Well, that's still good for getting slug and light bulbs, right? And crate. No, it didn't get the crate. So now I have two crates, and I can't get the two crates. I messed up, but I learned. Boy, did I learn. Okay, fine. I'll use some extra moves and open that up. All right, so I made a lot of mistakes. Not going to make those mistakes again. You'll see, I'm going to come back and do this without using the extra turns. I'll pause the recording and be right back. Actually, you know what? Uh, let's just go ahead and open our, our crates and see what fun things we get as we go. And now I'll pause and be back. Okay, well, I think I'll start with this one and I'll grab all this green. And I'm going to try to get to those light bulbs a little more quickly this time. That looks good, and that'll put the yellow together, right? Yes. And that'll put the blue together. There, we've already got an inroads. Can't make use of it yet, but at least we've got that open. Huh. Still not getting things together, but I think I get a bomb. Oh no, very close. Can I get a bomb with the green? No. Can I get a bomb with the purple? No. I think I'm going to take out the purple anyway and connect more green together. Mm, connected some green together. I just have to get into here. Why are these not matching up? Finally. There we go. There. That's what I need. So I'm collecting lights and bombs and hitting these guys all at the same time. Kind of. Now I'm going to vary from that. Come around here. I could do this with the blue. It's not very much. I think instead I'll do... I need to get a bomb. There. I'm going to do that, which will also bring the purple together. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful because I do have the slug also to deal with. Hold on, go this way to grab all of that. That gets me another bomb. Now, because this is so covered in slug sludge, I do need a bomb to open it, I think. There we go. And then these alternating are just driving me crazy. Here we go. Now we'll start clearing these up. Oh, hello. What if I do that? I kind of like that. I just can't get these guys to connect well. But look what I can do. Nope, hold on. Going this way. Ta-da! It's going to blow everything up. It's going to take out that purple bomb, but it's also going to collect a whole bunch of lights. It's going to hit that slug really hard. And now I can get to these lights, which have the crates behind them. Twelve moves to get all this done. All right, the purple nor the green are connecting really well, so I'll take one and then try to take the other. Yuck. Yuck. Nope. Not working. There. That's better. A little better. And we're getting more crates. And we can hit this crate now, and hopefully that turns green. There we go. And now we're getting bombs. I like that. All right, I'm feeling much better about this now. 
Look at that. Just the, you know, the way it changes color uh, can impact the board a lot. Now, remember, I only get, I, I get the bomb right before it hits the light bulb. So it's not going to be here. It's going to be, or it's not, it's here, not here. That's what I'm going to choose. It opens up a crate completely. Now I've got more bombs. Not the best locations. Not the best colors lining up here. Now we have something good here. So I grab these lights, which opens that crate, and then I come over here and go this route and hit that crate. So all crates are now collected, right? There we go. And we need to get seven lights in two moves, but I have a purple bomb. So that'll get some lights there. Plus I'm going to hit this directly. So two lights left. That's all I need. And thankfully I've got it. It was a close one. I almost didn't. But got that done. I feel good. And I will see you next time. Bye-bye.